Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party. Um, I kind of live here now. Yeah. Boop, 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 We're on Creeper Watch. It was nighttime when I logged in, and I don't have much of that stuff lit up at all. Yeah, so, um, hi, this is there, and welcome to Minecraft Land Party. I think I already said that. How are you doing? This is episode 177 of season two. Just kind of crazy um yeah no i did not do a server reset um have no plan on doing that anytime soon uh i want to there's a I, there's a certain challenge in making current world work reasonably well with 1.14 so when 1.14 becomes stable on spigot uh i do intend to upgrade to that but uh, for the time being, I have some things to do, and I have some stuff laying out here. So, there's a shipwreck right there, and this is 1.13 uh, terrain. Yeah, look at this. Let's go swimming. And um, I, I, had, I found some 1.13 terrain that wasn't that far from home. And so I went and... Um, oh, hey, look, clownfish. Whoa! Baby drowned! Uh, get get away from the baby drown. Um, yeah, so I got surprised it's not more of them actually. Uh, so I, I went out to this 1.13 area and opened up a brand new treasure map, hoping that you know maybe it would it would lead me to uh, some treasure, like a buried treasure somewhere nearby, and uh, it did not. It led me kind of a ways away from things. Came across the shipwreck, which is, oh, that's pretty cool. So I went down, and then there's a little structure next to the shipwreck there, which can't really see right now. I do have a boat in my inventory. Whoops. Um, <clears throat> actually, I should switch to the the trident, I think. Just in case. Um, yeah, and then I got, uh, I got overwhelmed by uh, a drowned with a trident that I did not see, and he was awfully close to me, and I wasn't prepped. For that at all and he killed me um fortunately i had the f3 screen open and i knew roughly where things were uh i knew where my stuff was see i got some stuff here Let's switch to the trident pop um <clears throat> and but i didn't have my i see i'm armored up i didn't have all my stuff so i went and grabbed my my little doom box and i grabbed I couldn't because they didn't have a um, doom box goes here potions box goes here and valuable stuff goes here ah so here was the buried treasure map let's take a look at it and look I pretty much do south of wherever it is and the dot isn't that small so I should be reasonably close to it so let's uh let's go find it I have some things to talk about. We're going to leave this stuff here, I think. No, I'm going to bring golden apples just in case I get into a spot. I don't need more arrows. Clock and this. Actually, they would be helpful to have. So let's just do this. Clock would be helpful. So I have other treasure maps here. I may not come back here. So let me get rid of these. Put them into here. Um... So yeah, I died, and uh, I had I had slept in a bed along my travels that was still there. So at least I didn't uh, didn't end up all the way back home, but in some ways ending up all the way back home would have been preferable because oh whoa sorry um, <clears throat> would have been preferable. Because uh, that's where all my stuff was, and the place where I put down the bed, I did not put down a ender chest. And 
So I was there on a spot where things were relatively safe, and there was a regular chest there, but there was no no other chest, so I didn't have any of my stuff. So I uh, I threw... I didn't really have anything, so I just went in and destroyed the bed, and went out and drowned in the water, went home, and then flew back out to these coordinates and got my stuff. So, let's see here. North is that way. Let's uh, let's go north. Um, so this was a bit of a distraction uh, because I really didn't intend to spend a lot of time exploring. <laughs> this was just supposed to be a quickie little. Oh, let's get some buried treasure. Um, that would have been nice, and uh, didn't didn't exactly work out. I put a lot more time into that than I expected. And see, now we're in deep ocean here, right? Is that what this is? This is just regular ocean. So this is not 1.13 territory. Um, so I'll just keep keep going here. We'll go north. And then we will do what we need to do. And I probably should have brought enough makings for another bed. That would have been smart. Anyway. Um, so I got a little distracted. I have not have not worked on the, the carrot farms in the pyramid haven't worked on the um, the village at all haven't worked on haven't haven't done squat mainly because I've been very work focused on working towards the magic castle audition which was this past oops slow down things slowed a little bit which was on Monday my third audition so for those of you not following along I have been for about the last year, Oh, this looks neat. Just because of the way it's rendering in. Oh, I'm going to run out of ocean here, aren't I? And of course, I'm rendering all kinds, generating all kinds of new terrain here. Which means I'm going to grow the world file, which is going to make the backups more complicated. Anyway. Um, let's go around this way. And we'll have to hike over land a little bit. So I'm probably not very close at all to this treasure, but at this point, even though it's kind of a sunk cost sort of situation, I really want to get it. So we are going to get it. We'll see if we can get it while on on camera. Let's get this back in our hands. Get the boat. Ah! We've gone past it. Huh. So, I need to go this way. I need a bed. I think I have enough stuff in my inner chest to make a bed. Um, huh. We want to go back south. Whoops. So, we head back this way. All right. <clears throat> so, um, where is, oh, that's right. Magic Castle. So the last, uh, I don't know, it was a little, about 18 months ago, I, I sort of had the thought of, a serious thought of, hey, I could join the Magic Castle. I should actually just get off my butt. I've been wanting to join for a long time, like something like 12 or 15 years. But it always just felt kind of impossible. Like, oh, you got to audition, and I'm, I'm not very good, and I don't really have anything to audition with. Um, and so, about 18 months ago, I saw a act in the close-up gallery at the Magic Castle. The magician named John Accardo, and he did a oh village. Uh, he did a trick. Um, turned out it was kind of called the three card prediction um the history there's a little bit uh, involved which i can get into it's an interesting history but not uh is there a bed in here there might be a bed in one of these rooms uh so i saw that and it was it was using skills that i had been working on hi buddy oh let's uh ugh uh, and so I had the I had the thought, oh, I could do this. 
I could actually I could actually learn how to do this. Hey, look, bookshelves. Hi. Um this axe has so touched on it, right? You can get bookshelves. Okay. Let's put torches back in here. Yeah, let's light this up a little bit. Nothing else I have a space I can be in. Oh, hello. You guys are in trouble. Um, I don't think there's going to be any beds here. This village is a little wacky. <laughs> really wacky. It's fun. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to head back into that uh, building, set up some stuff, and try to make a bed. So, back into the library. Was this the library? This was the library. Hence the librarian. Very good. Hi, buddy. Oh, hey, we got we got friends. Good. All right. So I got a crafting table here. That's good. So let's uh, let's put down this. Put down this, and I will leave this here. Yeah. So, um, so I saw that performance, and I'm like, oh, I can I could probably do this. So how about I do this? And so I have wool. Do I have? I, I, ideally, I would have some wool. And why do I only have four bone blocks? Sorry, I'm distracted. I'm trying to I'm trying to do two things at once here, which is never a good idea. Miscellaneous. What's in my misc box? Okay, I have a string. So from here, I have wood. Right? So I need three wood planks. That should be enough, right? So this becomes wood planks. And this becomes... Wool. Yeah. And then two, and then three, and then, uh, you know, just do it this way. Bed. <clears throat> Very good. And the bed I will put right over here. Plop, plop. And I can sleep in the bed. Very good. Okay, leave the bed there just in case. Leave the ender chest there just in case. All right, and then we put these back. Block and mask. All right, thank you for your hospitality, guys. Ah, oh, that's right. Oh, zombies just dying to meet us. Oh, it's a skeleton, and he's armed. Okay. All right, which way do we go? We want to head south west, right? Put the map back on the bar. Mostly south. Well, and then it will be west. Okay, cool. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> so then I started working seriously on preparing an audition for the Magic Castle and by the end of last year felt to the like I was at a point like oh you know what just just go and schedule an audition and wow we're super close north south wise at some point we're just gonna have to go that way so uh, I have a boat let's get in the boat so I scheduled an audition in the fall, like September-ish, I think, um, and got the first audition available. Wow, skated right past it. So, let's go around the horn here and head to the west. Oh, I may run out of ocean. 
but I, mo I have to go west more than I have to go south. So if we have to do this overland, we do this overland. Scheduled an audition. It was scheduled for the towards the end of the year. And then uh, I had an MS flare up and I had bad car accident. Oh, let's just get off the boat. Come on. Thank you, Minecraft. Uh, <clears throat> that bunny jumped a long ways. So, uh, so I rescheduled the audition until February. That was the first slot that they had available. I was like, okay, that gives me a few months. I don't have to like stress about that during the holidays. And so I worked on I worked on my audition. Came up with a routine. Did the whole bit. Dot's getting larger. So we need to head northwest, which is kind of this direction. Structure, no, that's not a structure. It just kind of looks like one. But we are super close to this treasure, it looks like. Which is great. Um, uh, so yeah, I went in in February and went and did the audition. I was nervous and I was... And I was I was kind of rushing a little bit uh, for reasons which uh, I received information shortly before the audition that made me think that there was a there was a time limit that I, a strict time limit that I had to stick to, uh, which turns out there is not, but. Um, Okay, so we have to go. It's that direction. <clears throat> Oops. So, <clears throat> I, uh... So anyway, I was... I was nervous, and I was... Didn't know what to expect, and I kind of... Was trying to rush through my routine, which is not what you're supposed to be doing. And, uh, and so I, whoa. Should be able to see it. Should be right over there. Um, and, uh, and they said, no, thanks. Not, not today, but, uh, come back again. Come back in a month. And a month turned into, um, Turned into a few months. So I had my second. It's right here. It's right here. So my second audition was in April. And oh man, I'm standing on top of it. Pretty much. Okay. I need a shovel. Uh, so that I went back in April, did a second audition. Uh, second audition, I thought went reasonably well. The problem was that I had, wait, my actual tools are not in here, in here, right? Um, actual audition I thought the audition went second audition went really well um, and but the problem is that uh, one of the tricks didn't go well at all and as a result I um, they said no thank you try again in a couple months and so I went in uh, went and practiced some more and uh, talked to people and ended up going back in on Monday in July for those of you not watching in recent times and uh, and that one went really well and they said yes please yeah thank you very much and so So 
so that was good. Um, and they let me know a couple days later, and I am now a member of the Magic Castle. I'm waiting. I have to go through an orientation, which is happening later in the month. Hello, dude. Whoa, multiple dudes. Where's the other one? There was another one. Maybe I scared him away. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so I can't actually go and visit the castle <clears throat> until after the orientation. It's a little frustrating because my birthday is coming up uh, a couple days before the orientation. And I would very much like to... Oh, baby dude. Uh, and I would very much like to go celebrate... Whoa. Oh, Pufferfish. Hang on a second. Uh, put this down on the bar. Let's go get ourselves a Pufferfish. Uh, but, <clears throat> but anyway, I am, I passed the audition. That's the important thing. Um, and I am now a member of the Magic Castle, which is super exciting. Uh, and I will be, so I will be celebrating my birthday at the castle, just not, um, not on my birthday itself. I have other plans for the birthday, other magic related plans, uh, kind of as a after... Uh, sort of backup plans, but that is <clears throat> that is the plan. So anyway, uh, that was update. Good news update. Magic Castle update number one. Uh, so nobody has to hear me complaining about Magic Castle stuff again. At least not the audition side of things. Oh, sun's going down. Obviously, did not find this thing yet. Let me get out my stuff. Let me make another bed. Um, and yeah, so let me do all that and then we'll come back and we will see what other updates there are to be done. So anyway, that's the that's the Magic Castle news. Um, there is, sorry, the air conditioner is on because it got hot. We've had pretty, whoa, that was fascinating. Had a pretty mild winter uh, summer so far this year, and um, it's been very nice, in fact. But um, but it got hot today, and I was supposed to be up with uh, celebrating a, another friend's birthday today at an animal park, with animal like a animal safari park in Los Angeles. Uh, such a thing does exist. Yeah, it would be very cool to go see, but, um, yeah, it, but they were expecting it to be like 102, 103 degrees up there today, and, uh, yeah, I have MS, and heat and MS don't really go together, so, uh, probably complained about this in the past, too, and I apologize if it's redundant, but, um, yeah, I don't I don't do well in heat. In fact, yesterday when it was it was in the 80s at my house, um, I uh, spent a little bit of time outside just working on stuff out there, and just a little bit of time was enough to kind of completely wipe me out. And by seven o'clock ish. Maybe it's out on this tip here. I don't know. Nope, that can't be right. 
Got to be in the right general area here. I don't know. Uh, so anyway, yeah, just a little bit of time in the outside in the 80 degree heat was enough to kind of wipe me out. And I ended up going to bed early last night, like seven o'clock, which is kind of crazy. Um, and then, uh, you know what we're going to do? We're going to build ourselves a little wall here. Uh, so yeah, I went to bed at like seven o'clock and, and ended up sleeping all night. Uh, didn't wake up until after eight, uh, which was, uh, which was unexpected, but I was just beat and, I'm st and I woke up feeling tired. Like I did not feel like I got a good night's sleep, which is not, not great, but, uh, that's the way it goes sometimes. Okay. Okay, let me uh, let me figure out. Hi, turtles. No, I was this is not no this is not a wall. I'm not trying to keep you out. I'm just trying to keep like zombies and stuff. Okay, let me find this thing, and we will uh, then head back home. 